what does foundation mean in foundation models in generative ai so let us discuss this i will try my best to explain what does this foundation model mean in generative ai and how is it helping and what are the opportunities and risks associated with foundation models right and then what are the applications what are the technologies all these things we are going to discuss and one more thing is that i am going to refer a very special report released by stanford institute right so that also i am going to show you a glimpse of that so that we come to know the purpose of foundation models where we have reached as far as foundation models are concerned in generative ai what does the future look like all these things i am going to explain in this video what is a foundation model it is trained on a huge amount of data it is a single model literally very huge amount of data and a single model can adapt to many applications no doubt there will be some kind of fine tuning required to let it adapt to many applications right that we are going to see in our future videos but for now you just need to remember these two things that it is trained on huge amount of data and it can adapt to more than one type of applications or requirements for example you can see the type of data which we have on the left hand side that is text images and foundation model is trained on all such type of data and towards the end of this video i am also going to talk about how foundation models are different than traditional model where we are training those models separately on each type of data for separate tasks but here if you see a single model is getting trained on different type of data to adapt for different type of requirements it can solve question answers it can help us in sentiment analysis now what is sentiment analysis basically to generate some information from a piece of text that whether it is a positive review or it is a negative review or that can be not only from text it can be from audio or video also by using the foundation models information extraction from certain type of text audio video image captioning and so on right this is list is not exhaustive but just to give you an idea that these are the some type of tasks which can be done using a single foundation model which was not possible before foundation model or the transformation architecture which is the backbone of this opportunities and risks of foundation model let us see capabilities a foundation model can lead to work in multiple languages it can help us solving complex problems linguistic linguistic problems like translation from one language to another language or uh, understanding those things which were not possible before vision aspects right uh, all those things can be done with a single model application healthcare to analyze the medical images uh, right and uh, the medical text research text automatically uh, generating value out of that same way in the field of law education there are many opportunities like so these are some of the technology areas where opportunities lies in terms of research uh, or generating applications building applications and most of these because uh, see if, if i take an example of evaluation so evaluation of foundation model is evolving as it has started its journey uh, in 2017 or 2018 right since that point the evaluation of foundation models is getting evolved over a period of time earlier it was very basic now it is getting matured uh, companies are also uh, joining hands 
uh, so that there are better evaluation criteria and we have more responsible foundation models which can help us uh, in solving real world problems in all these areas which are listed on the right hand side same way data quality also plays a key role right security robustness so all these areas uh, provide a lot of opportunities at the same time there are risks also associated with this so certain kind of risks are that uh, uh, it can be misused right somebody can uh, use its power to generate malicious content uh, copyrighted content uh, which can lead to legal issues right same way because of bias and other issues uh, uh, the set of uh, developers who have been working on training these foundation models right they might be biased so those kind of things are also opposed to uh, certain level of risks uh, in this area role of human beings right if you see here right from the data creation phase right and till the data consumption phase producer and consumer both are human beings at both ends you can see that generator also is human consumer is also a human right so it is a very crucial role critical role which we as a human being are playing and bit in between these layers like curation training and adaptation there should be thoughtful data curation and adaptation and these should be part of responsible development of these ai systems right so that's why it can be more useful to us than the harmful to us coverage of foundation model again uh, let me show you so world has over 6000 languages but foundation models are trained only on certain tiny percentage of world's languages right so foundation models cannot solve all the world's problems a linguistic linguistic problems as of now right it will be trained on future uh, different research communities have been uh, training uh, uh, the uh, foundation models as per their regional languages right so we will see a lot of changes lot of evolution in the coming years or months right because these are evolving at a very rapid rate so just wanted to share that this is still the beginning right uh, and lot way to go so there is a lot of scope in near future are foundation models different from traditional models let us see so traditional model if we want to create a task or application for question answering system or chatbot detecting an object translation predictions right we will first of all have to have different set of data and different model models respective models to train those models on that particular data and get that task done from the models on the other hand foundation models as i told you in the beginning of this video so that foundation models can help a single model can help right with in multiple tasks by getting trained on different pieces of data and i'm not saying that one model is able to solve all kind of problems generic problems for everyone but these should be able to solve the most of these tasks by fine tuning and there are other techniques also which can be used but they need not to have uh, multiple foundation models or multiple models uh, for that matter so that is the biggest difference between these two type of models foundation models and traditional models so this is the site which i was referring to stanford university that center for research on foundation models stanford university human centered artificial intelligence right so they have also listed down what is the definition of foundation model why do they care 
right if you see here foundation models have demonstrated impressive behavior but can fail unexpectedly harbor biases and are poorly understood nonetheless they are being deployed at scale right so they have come up with a mission right that it is an interdisciplinary initiative born out of stanford institute that aims to make fundamental advances in the study development and deployment of foundation model so if you click on report here you will see on the opportunities and risks of foundation model it is 200 pages report more than 200 pages of report right so just wanted to show you that uh, i have used this report uh, to some extent moving on upcoming topics so these are the upcoming topics uh, i have mentioned in the previous video also where i have introduced generative ai uh, along with some demos also so here foundation model topic is covered in this video and i aim to cover rest of the topics also in upcoming videos along with whatever new information i can share uh, during this journey thank you so much for staying thus far and watching this video i'm looking forward to get your feedback and uh, happy learning please feel free to hear your feedback in the comment section of this video or on this social platform right and i look forward for your guidance support as always thank you